In this video, we will show you how to quickly create a selective soldering program uh, for your selective soldering equipment. In this case, we will be outputting the file that's compatible with the ACE selective solder machine. First thing we do is import our CAD data. We do that by clicking File, Smart Open, and then we point at the folder where the data files are located. As you can see, it will open up all the compatible files in that folder and all the subfolders. And the best data floats towards the top, and that's usually the data with XY um, uh, pin netlist data, and then the less desirable. Uh, data such as Gerber f is at the bottom. You can uh, import Gerber files if that's all you have. Otherwise, we will just choose a CAD file. Okay, and it comes up on the screen. Now we're going to add some bill of material information. We'll import the bomb. We have programmable bomb importing. And create a bomb template for practically any type of bomb and then import it okay it'll cross check the bomb file when it comes in for any errors or discrepancies and now the next thing we want to do is we will go to our place AOI x-ray menu we're going to mark our reference one point and then we'll mark our second reference point and the uh, next thing we'll do is go to our the machine output that we want in this case it's going to be the ACE selective solder I will do the top side uh, the window that comes up is the panel dimension window and uh, offset uh, so this is a one-up panel, so I'll just leave it as is, but if you had a, um, a four-up panel, you would put that in. Uh, the Unisoft software will optimize against the panel on both the flux runs and the solder runs, so that can save you um, a lot of machine time. I'll click OK, and now we're just going to generate the output file. Okay, and let's take a look at that file that we just created. And basically, this is your optimized flux run for the machine, and your optimized solder run for the selective solder machine. And we'd do the same thing for the bottom if we had bottom parts.